Mars has long been a place of interest. NASA and other space agencies are gearing up to send humans to the Red Planet, hoping that one day we may even call this place home. Interestingly, in recent years, various probes and rovers have found some interesting things on the surface, leading to photographs being shared around, and theories to be put forward. One photograph that was captured a while back shows what looks like large marks on the surface of Mars, along with an object at the end that appears to be curving off at an angle. When the images were first captured, it led to people sharing their opinions on what they thought this object was, along with some pointing out that there appears to be two objects within this image, with both of them making a sharp turn. It's hard to guess how big these objects are, along with how big the tracks are that they've left behind, but as some have mentioned they must be quite large in order to be picked up by the probe. One user said the following, You can see this thing turning. Also it looks to be quite big. Not sure what we're looking at here, but I don't think this is a rover, because you can see two of these things close together, and there's never been two rovers within that distance of one another. End quote. Others have suggested that there's things happening on Mars that the rovers may have missed, leading some to scan through these old Mars photographs in the hopes of finding something interesting. Although NASA has said that Mars and its atmosphere are too harsh to hold life anymore, noting that the surface of Mars is constantly exposed to high doses of cosmic radiation, there's others who have speculated that every so often it looks like there's things that appear to be moving on the surface. This isn't the only interesting discovery. NASA said that the Curiosity rover found evidence of Martian bacteria. Only a few years ago, NASA made an incredible discovery, in which the initial signs of life on Mars arose for NASA astrobiologists and research scientists back in 2004, and then again later confirmed back during the landing of the Martian probe in 2014. The private space agency originally saw signs of a methane plume ejecting from the surface of Mars, and began to quickly theorize its implications as an organic molecule of which only finds natural formation via the creation of a variety of bacteria. After many sleepless nights, engineers of the space agency worked to send a Martian rover, with the capability of testing the Martian surface for additional organic molecules. Later in 2014, Martian rover Curiosity began collecting evidence of methane traces in the Martian atmosphere, and made a startling discovery. The Martian rover found that the methane on Mars grew more concentrated by season in the Martian atmosphere, and directly correlated with the Martian seasons overall. This led researchers to believe that this correlation between concentration by season was additional proof to the hypothesis that Mars contains some form of life. Methane is also an organic molecule, and the majority of methane on Earth also correlates with our seasons as certain bacteria and microbes eject this organic molecule into the atmosphere during summer and autumn seasons, similar to what the data shows in spikes of methane across the Martian atmosphere. Although definitive signs of life have yet to be observed on Mars, the odds of this observation seem to be more and more promising with the passing years, as Curiosity uncovers additional complex organic molecules, and continues its drilling process to locate biosignatures of life. This has led many researchers to theorize that the formation of these bacteria could have taken place over millions of years, as well as the fact that there could have been at one point in time, far more complex life on the surface of Mars, before the complete removal of its atmosphere, leading to a number of extremophiles still existing on the Martian surface today. Another NASA image that's often used by people to suggest that there's life on Mars is this one, showing what appears to be large streaks on the surface. NASA even covered this on their website by saying the following. NASA photographs have revealed bright new deposits seen in two gullies on Mars, that suggest water carried sediment through them sometime during the past seven years. Michael Meyer, lead scientist for NASA's Mars Exploration Program, 
said that these observations give the strongest evidence to date that water still flows occasionally on the surface of Mars. Liquid water as opposed to water ice and water vapour known to exist at Mars is considered necessary for life. The new findings heighten intrigue about the potential for microbial life on Mars. The Mars orbital camera on NASA's Mars Global Surveyor provided new evidence of the deposits in images taken in 2004 and 2005. Michael Mullin of Mullin Space Science Systems said that the shapes of these deposits are what you would expect to see if the material were carried by flowing water. They have finger-like branches on the downhill end and are easily diverted around small obstacles. Malin is principal investigator for the camera and lead author of a report about the findings published in the journal Sciences. The atmosphere of Mars is so thin and the temperature so cold that liquid water cannot persist at the surface. It would rapidly evaporate or freeze. Researchers have said that water could remain liquid long enough after breaking from an underground source to carry debris downslope before totally freezing. The two fresh deposits are each several hundred meters or yards long. End quote. So what do you make of these interesting discoveries? And what do you think these photographs show? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.